Now let's look at another linear inequality. We want to graph y is less than or equal to 1 half x minus 1. We'll begin by graphing y equals 1 half x minus 1. We can use the fact that this is in slope intercept form to help us graph. We're going to identify the slope as equal to 1 half. And we know that our y intercept, which we can use the variable b for, is equal to negative 1. We'll begin by plotting the y intercept at the value negative 1. Next, we use the fact that we can have our slope as an indication of how to get to another point by using rise of a run. From this point that we've graphed, we're going to move up one unit, that's our rise, and then move two units to the right, that's our run. We'll plot our second point. We're now going to draw in this line as the border between two half planes. We want to see that in this case, we have y is less than or equal to 1 half x minus 1. That means that we want to include the equation as part of the solution set. That is, we're going to include all the points on that line. So we're going to draw it in as a solid line. Next, we can use the fact that we have y is less than or equal to this value in order to tell us that since it's solved for y, we know that our y values run vertically. A y value that's greater would be above the line. A y value that's less than would be below the line. Since y is less than this value, we're going to shade in all of the points that would be below the line as our solution.